clarinetist has been awarded C-350,000, $266,500 in damages after his girlfriend sabotaged his music career by deleting an email offering a valuable scholarship. Eric Abramovitz's then-girlfriend Jennifer Lees then sent emails in his name to keep him from leaving her, but when he found out he sued her. Abramovitz had been desperate to win a place on a course at the Colborne Conservatory of Music in Los Angeles, which was led by one of the world's greatest clarinet masters, Hugh Gillard. After flying to Los Angeles in 2014 for a live audition in front of Mr. Gillard he was sent an email to tell him he had been awarded a full scholarship offer worth about $50,000 a year. But the email was intercepted by fellow music student Lee, who had access to his laptop along with his email account because he trusted her, BuzzFeed News reported. She found the email and replied in Abramovitz's name, saying simply that he could not accept as he would be elsewhere, and then deleted it. She then created an email account in Mr. Gillard's name, giladuhuta09 at gmail.com to falsely tell Mr. Abramovitz he had not been successful. Lee then invented an alternative offer for the University of Southern California, where Mr. Gillard also taught, but with a fraction of the funding. Lee knew he would have to refuse the offer as it would have been too costly, said Abramovitz, who has recently accepted an offer to join the Toronto Symphony Orchestra. I was numb when I read the email. I had to read it a few more times, Mr. Abramovitz, now 24, told BuzzFeed News. When I found out I didn't get it, it was really hard to deal with. I went through some really dark, sad angry days. We were living together at the time, so she was the one to console me when I found out. It's really sick now that I look back on it. He stayed on in Montreal to finish his music degree, but the couple's relationship soon fell apart. Share this article Share Abramovitz's suspicion was aroused when he met Gillard some years later at another audition at the University of Southern California. When the pair started talking, Gillard asked him why he was auditioning again having previously rejected a scholarship offer. Abramovitz decided to try all back through his old emails and found email the email sent in Gillard's name to him. Gillard told him he did not recognize the words or the email address and that it was not from him. Abramovitz then became suspicious that his ex-girlfriend was behind the emails, which was confirmed when he found he could access the fake Gmail account by using one of her favorite passwords. In a damages case filed in Ms. Lee's home province of Ontario he cited loss of reputation, loss of educational opportunity and a delay in entering his chosen profession. The Ontario judge awarded the C-300,000 Mr. Abramovitz requested, plus an additional C-50,000, to express the court's revulsion at what Ms. Lee has done if the ward also covered the personal loss suffered by Mr. Abramovitz by having a closely held personal dream snatched from him by a person he trusted. Lee's actions were a despicable interference in Mr. Abramovitz's career, the judge ruled, 